So what I'd like to do, ladies and gentlemen, is show you how to multiply a mino monomial times a binomial. And a couple things we need to remember about this. There's a couple rules. First is your generic rule of distributive property. And what the distributive property states is anytime you have a number outside of the parentheses, that number needs to be multiplied times every term inside of your parentheses. So what we like to do is a lot of times write these little um, lines here to represent. That's going to be a times b. And since that's a positive a, plus a times c. All right? So that's something you guys are going to want to have written down and understand so you can use. The next thing is something else that we've already learned in this class, which is whenever you multiply a monomial times another monomial, and they have the exact same base, you add the exponents. OK? So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use those two rules to help me solve this problem. So the first thing I notice is I have to multiply my 2y times both of my terms inside of here. I know instead of a, I have a 2y, right? But you can just treat it like that. So it's going to be 2y times y. Then, since that's a positive 2, it's another positive 2y times, I'll put it in parentheses since it's negative, a negative 4. Did you guys see that? OK? Then, simply all we need to do is use our order of operation, or use our rules. Now I have two monomials multiplied by each other. With these, we have exponents. Since these have the same bases and exponents, I'm going to add their exponents. Those both have an exponent of 1. Here, I don't have another y, so I just simply multiply my numbers, which will provide me with a negative 8y. 2y squared minus 8y. Done. Got it?